Hello everyone, my name is Yan Yizhen. Today I'm going to introduce our work Tuber, a tubelet transformer for video action detection. Action detection can be frame level and tubelet level. Frame level detection, as shown in left figure, only detects action bounding boxes on each keyframe in a video clip. Tubelet level detection, shown in right figure, outputs a sequence of bounding boxes across all frames in a video clip to cover an action instance a long time. We call a sequence of detected bounding boxes an action tubelet. This work targets on tubelet action detection. A common approach for frame level detection relies on first detecting actor bounding boxes on each keyframe, then duplicates the bounding boxes a long time to perform ROI pooling over time to generate the spatial temporal feature for recognizing actions. This method assumes actors will not move over a short period of time. There are also existing tubelet level frameworks that utilize 3D cuboids as anchors and then learn the model to refine these cuboids. Unfortunately, these 3D cuboids are not effective over a short time period. We propose a tubelet transformer we call Tuber to model the action detection problems as a sequential to sequential translation task. Without any proposal or hypothesis, Tuber localize and recognize actions from tubelet specific representations. Given a video clip, Tuber first applies a 3D backbone to extract video features. A transformer encoder decoder is then utilized to transform the video feature into a set of tubelet specific features. From each tubelet specific feature, a regression head is used to predict the bounding boxes in the action tubelet, and an action head is applied to recognize the action being performed in the tubelet. In order to generate tubelet specific features, we adopt a set of tubelet query embeddings. To model the spatial temporal relations in the tubelet queries, we first propose a tubelet attention module. The tubelet attention module contains two self attention layers. The spatial attention layers learn spatial relationships between bounding boxes on each frame independently, and the temporal attention learns to link the boxes for each action over time. Such design make our tuber more efficient and effective for spatial temporal action model. After the tubelet specific features are generated, the bounding boxes and action classification for each tubelet can be done simultaneously with independent task specific heads. We first propose the action switch head to remove non action boxes in a tubelet by including an FC layer for predicting whether a box prediction still predicts the actor performing the tubelet action. It is known that context is important for understanding sequences. During the action classification head, we further propose a leverage spatial temporal video context to help video sequence understanding. We strengthen the tubelet specific feature by curing them from context feature available from video clip and use the strengthened features for final classification. We first evaluate our tuber on commonly used AVA datasets. The tuber achieved state of art performance compared with previous work on both AVA 2.1 and AVA 2.2. We want to highlight that the tuber outperforms previous SOTA end-to-end -end models with a significant margin as shown in red, which shows the effectiveness of the proposed tubelet transformer design. The tuber also outperforms all the previous two-stage SOTAs, even with tricks like multi scale crop as shown in blue. We also tested and achieved the SOTA performance on UCF and Jetune DB datasets. We first provide visualizations of the tubelet specific features by overlaying the tubelet specific feature activation over the input frames using attention rollout. We can clearly see that the proposed tuber is able to generate highly discriminative tubelet specific features. The action switch works as expected, which initiates or cuts the tubelet when the action starts or stops. Finally, the tuber generalizes well to scale changes, and the generated tubelets are tightly associated with tubelet specific features as expected. Here, we give demos on three challenge cases where other methods are likely to fail, such as videos including various scales, long distance moving, and short changes. The tuber works well on all these three scenarios. Thanks for your attention, and please join our post session on 23rd June for further discussion on-site or online.